Hello and welcome to the Chocolate Factory Simulator. So full disclosure, I signed up for the playtest and like immediately got it. So I'm pretty sure if you click on the button, you can probably get it too. But I am obsessed with a restaurant in Universal Studios in Orlando called Toothsome Chocolate Emporium. And this game reminds me just like that. Like it reminds me of that so much. So I'm really excited to hop in. So let's jump in and find out what this is all about. Uh, okay, first steps. Welcome to your very own chocolate manufacturer. Create de delicious confections of various whimsical designs. Sell them to customers each who each have their own specific tastes and requirements. Develop your workshop and become a household name known on every airship. Okay, this phone ringing, it's throwing me off here. Take your first order. Use the telephone hanging on the wall to take your first order. I would love to. I need this to stop ringing. Oh, look at it. It's so cool. Uh, oh, phone. Here we go. Whoa. Okay. Hello there. Nothing ignites a chocolate craving like a long trip. Please take my order. Uh, okay. So I guess it's telling us what he wants. Difficulty easy. Bitter chocolate. Tempered, yes. Crystallized, yes. Chocolate bar is the product type. Quality basic. Total weight, 100 grams. Quantity of one. Let's go ahead and accept it. Uh, great, in that case, I'll be waiting for the order to complete. Spectacular news, chocolatier. We've received our first order. Go pick up the ingredients so that we may start out. Oh, I didn't get a chance to finish reading that. Okay. All right. Oh, bit bit laggy. Um, pick up a bag of cocoa. Bag of cocoa. Do I have to leave to get a bag of cocoa? Do I not have cocoa here? Uh... Okay, I'm assuming I have to leave. Oh, through the doors. Oh, oh, okay, so we have a stock room. <gasps> oh my gosh, holy cow. Look at this. It's amazing. Wow, okay, all right. I'm also getting some serious Bioshock vibes here. Okay, so let's grab our bag of cocoa. Oh, okay, pouring. While holding the ingredients, interact with the container into which you want to pour them. Use the mouse to adjust the pouring speed. The slower you pour, the more precise the measurement will be. Makes sense. I don't want to put it into the garbage chute. I'm assuming I have to put it into a bowl. No, okay. Oh, cocoa butter jar. Assigned to robot. Pick up okay well hold on a second wait where where am i pouring this am i pouring it into here i think i think i do okay can i just put it down drop okay all right so now we'll come back in here pick this up and we'll put that there okay pick up a bag of sugar okay uh please give me the bag of sugar thank you okay and we'll drop it here Add cocoa to the pot. 40 grams. Okay. Pick this up. To the pot we go. Okay. So pour. Uh, how much do I need? 40. Okay. We can go a little bit faster. Maybe just a, a little bit faster. <laughs> okay. And we are good. Good. Okay. Whoa. Oh boy. I, I spilled a little bit. It's fine. Okay. Add cocoa butter to the pot. 40 grams of this as well. Am I getting it into the pot? I feel like I'm pouring it all over the counter. All right. Let's go a little bit faster. And 30. And, oh. Okay. Maybe just a little bit more. Okay. We're good. Fantabulous. And now we need our sugar. Pick this up. Pour it into the pot. Uh, and... Whoop. A little bit more. Okay. Okay. Okay, we did it. Fantastic. Now it's time to turn on the machinery. Feed the furnace. The, to feed the fur... But... Nougat! I didn't have time to read that! It's too fast! Er, okay. Uh, 
Where do you want... Oh, bag of coal. Okay. Okay. Pick up bag of coal. I have one. Can I pick up multiples? I cannot. Okay, where's the... But where's the furnace? Where is the furnace? Where does it go? Okay, I'm gonna just plop it down right there, I guess. And then we'll pick this one up and we'll plop it down. And we'll pick this up. Machines need powered. Your machines need steam to work. To create pressure, put some coal into the furnace. I would love to. Can you tell me where this furnace is? Okay. Oh, here it is. All right. Open the door. New event in the world. Okay. Put in. Okay. We put the whole bag inside. Like canvas and all. All right. Got it. And we'll throw that in there. Oh. And then we grab our last bag that I put on the counter. It's very strange that I have to left click to pick up items. Okay. Pull the furnace starter. Hold and pull. Holding. Oh, you actually have to pull the thing back. Pull the mouse back. Oh, uh oh. Okay. So now we move the valve to 60%. Oh, okay, it's a bit awkward to do this. It's okay. We got it. Okay, pick up the pot. Place the pot on the stove. Okay, picking up the pot. Putting the pot on the stove. I will grab my spatula. I will not grab my spatula because I have to turn this on. Oh, okay. This step is key. Chocolate is an incredibly fragile entity. It needs to be handled with the utmost care. Make sure that the temperature is just right before stirring. Okay, heat it to a temperature of, how do I? Okay, okay, so if I look down at it, it shows me what its temperature is at. So we're at 20 degrees Celsius. We need it to be a little bit hotter. Can I? Oh, oh wait, this has to be at like 40%, right? Okay, now it's slowly going up, so maybe I should take my spatula and start stirring. Oh, the ingredients are too low to stir. Oh. Oh, we have to wait for it to heat up first. Okay, we can do that. Okay, so I cranked the heat up just a little bit to like 70%, and we're getting pretty close to our 40 degree temperature. So let's pick up our spatula and get ready to stir. Oh, just a little bit more. A little bit more. There we go. All right, let's stir it. And we're moving the mouse in a circle. And we're stirring. And we're stirring. And we're stirring. And we're done. Uh-oh. Oh, wait. Oh, boy. No, I want to shut this off. There we go. Okay. I, I closed it. It's closed. Close the valve supplying the heater. Oh, oh, oh. This, this valve. Got it. No, oh, that's the wrong direction. Okay, that's closed. Set press valve to the optimal level of 60%. Okay. And there we go. Select the chocolate shape, which is up here. Oh! Uh, chocolate cubes. Load. Okay, and now open the press with the wheel. Okay. Oh, 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 this is so cool. Okay, so pour the liquor from the pot. I think you mean the liquid, but okay, that's fine. We're not going to judge. And we'll pour that. Am I getting it in here? I feel like I'm missing. Oh, okay, okay, it's going in, it's going in, it's going in, okay, all right. Okay, empty, fantastic, we'll go plonk that down over here. And now we uh, close the press, start the press, and wait for it to finish. Okay, Whoa. uh-oh. Okay, all right, this way closes it, okay, and now we pull the lever cronk. Oh, it's doing things. It's doing things. Is that a progress bar? 
Okay. And wait for it to finish. Okay, well, I guess while we wait for that, we can do- oh, oh, What a perfectly sublime chocolate bar. Not one flesh wearer will be able to resist such a sweet confection. Even I am tempted to take a bite, but alas, I am a robot. I cannot consume food. S such is my fate. Regardless, it's time to package the chocolate. Make it as something, something, something that I could not read. <gasps> Look at our first chocolate bar. It looks so good. Okay. Set the packing machine to the optim- Okay, okay. The what now? Oh, this one over here, okay. Uh, can I, it says clo- Oh, I gotta go put our chocolate down, hold on. Let's plonk that on the table here. We gotta have a free hand to do this, okay. And we want this to be set at 60. Uh, that's 55 and 60. Place the chocolate bar in the packaging area. Where'd my chocolate bar go? Oh, it fell through the table. Can I, can I crouch? Please let me crouch. Oh my gosh. Oh, this isn't good. Oh, this is not good. I, I can't. I can't. <laughs> oh no, what have I done? Why is my candy on the floor? Is there a crouch button? Settings, uh, controls. Okay, sprints. Just MLB and MRB. Okay, a, a additive interaction. Move forward, move backwards, sprint. I just, but I need, I need to crouch. I gotta get under my table and get this chocolate bar off the floor. Oh my gosh. Oh boy. Oh no. Oh, 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 oh no. Oh, this isn't good, guys. This isn't good. Uh, can I please, please, please have my chocolate bar off the floor? Please. Please let me get this chocolate bar off the floor. Why did it do this? Why? Oh, gosh. Can I make another? Will you let me make another, or are you going to basically, like, lock me out? Okay. We're going to try to make another. Okay. It was a pot. Okay, we have our pot. We'll plonk that back down onto the heater. We will grab our 40, I think it was. Uh, I think it was 40. Oh boy, a little over. It's okay, it's okay. I'm panic pouring now, oh geez. Okay, and then we needed 40 of this, I think. And, oh, oh. Okay, we're good. We're, oh, oh boy. All right. And then we'll plonk that down right here. And then our bag of sugar. And we will pour this one. I think we needed 20 of this. Uh, uh. 18. Come on, a little bit more. Okay, okay, okay. We're good. We're good. Okay, now we'll plonk that down. Now I have to go turn on the heat. Uh, first of all, I'm going to shut this off, which is this way. Okay, and now we're going to, uh, shut this off, which is this way. And we're going to turn this on to 60, I believe it was, which is right here. And now we're going to come back over here and we are going to turn our valve to, I think I had it set to 70. And that seemed to work. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. I just gotta cook this. I'll be our bees. Okay, we have our replacement chocolate bar. <laughs> and now we're going to plonk it here. Okay. Choose packaging. You can choose your package. Oh! Okay. Simple box. Load. Fantastic. And now we hold and pull the lever cronk. There's no power available to the, to the machine. Why don't I have power available? Oh, cause I turned it off, right. And I think this needed to be at 60. So we'll do that. Okay, now we can pull the lever cronk. Ugh, there we go. <gasps> oh, it's in the machine. Oh, we have a chocolate bar ready for devouring. The only thing left is to deliver it to our customer. <gasps> oh, look how cool. Look how cool. Okay, uh, put the package my chocolate into this. Package my chocolate? <laughs> the, pa 
packaged chocolate into the shipping machine. Got it. Open the door. In you go. Uh, close the door. Hit the button. <gasps> oh my gosh. <gasps> that is so cool. And wait for the Zeppelin to pick up the parcel. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. Uh, I hit the button. Are we still just waiting for the Zeppelin? I hear it. Oh my god, there it is! Oh, that's so cool! Oh, I love it. Oh, I love it so much. Oh, is it gonna land on my head? Oh, and it just gets zerped up inside of there. Oh, that is so cool. It looks delicious. I can't wait to consume it. Good luck in your future endeavors, chocolates here. Thank you, Mr. Hawk. Your reputation has increased by 50. Your current reputation is now 80. Keep up the good work. Ah, the first satisfied customer. It is a cause for celebration, but we must not grow complacent. Maintaining our workshop in good condition is just as important as creating the chocolate. Time for some repairs. Okay. Repairs. What do you want me to take? The wrench? Yes, it's telling me to pick up the wrench. If I just looked up and read, tighten any loose bolts on the press. Okay. Uh, oh, that's a loose one. Uh, this way. Okay. So moving the mouse across to the left <laughs> is tightening it. I feel like the, that's backwards. It's righty tighty lefty loosey just so you all know all right i guess we can oh wait no we're not done yet we're not done yet okay we've got another loose bolt oh right here okay and we'll tighten this one to the left oh, that's interesting okay it's a ratchet wrench good to know and we have another loose bolt right here Yep, it's got to go to the left. It's throwing me off completely. <laughs> okay, got it. Tighten any loose bolts in the press. Oh, there's another one over here. This place is just falling apart. Come on, get that tight. Get it on there. Oh, okay. All right, let's go put our wrench back onto our tool bench. Co what? Oh, communication module for robot. I want the robot. Hello? Good day, I would like some chocolate. It needs to keep me awake through another day of writing. It needs a good kick, please. Okay, so, ooh, almond. Mm. Okay, I'm in. Use a mortar. Using a mortar and pestle, grind the ingredients until you obtain the desired texture. Okay. Add the ground ingredients to the chocolate. Remember that the perfect chocolate bar weighs 100 grams. Therefore, if you want your chocolate to contain 20 grams of nuts, you need to pour 80 grams of liquid chocolate into the press form. Yep, that makes sense. That math adds up. Uh, oh, <gasps> what's this one? Strawberry? Almonds? Pistachio? Cinnamon? Is this coffee? I swear, if this is coffee. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, wow. I've just realized. That is so cool. Look at all the piping. Oh, man. I love it. There's so many things to look at. Okay, so we're going to pull this down. We need 20 grams of almonds. And there we go. Uh, pouring spot. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I forgot to put the mortar down. Okay, we put... And now we pull the valve and we get our 20 grams of almonds. Ah, something more exciting. Chocolate truly is astounding in its ability to remain delicious with almost anything that you add to it. I believe is what it said. I cannot tell. All right, so we'll plonk our mortar here. We'll use this and we will grind the crap out of these almonds. Oh, yeah. Wait, is that not done? Is it grounded? To fine. Okay. So we're at coarse. And now we're at medium. Okay. We'll do it again. And 
Nobody likes living in dirt. Use the garbage chute to get rid of empty packages or contents from dishes. Okay. Uh, add cocoa to the pot. Okay, so let's grab our uh, pot and plonk that onto the heater. Oh, we have a little bit of chocolate in there because I, I went a little bit over. And our garbage chute was... I saw it here somewhere. I think it's back in this room, mayhaps? Yes. Here we go. Okay, pour. Okay, we should be good. All right. Back to the heater. Plonk that down. We should be empty. Fantastic. Okay, so we need our cocoa. We can go ahead and pour 23 grams. Okay, it seems like an odd number, but it's okay. And 23. Fantabulous. Plonk that down. Cocoa butter. And this is the cocoa butter. So 23 grams of that. And whoop, whoop. Oh, we went a little bit over. It's okay. It'll be fine. <laughs> It'll be fine. Powdered milk. Is that this stuff? Bottle of milk. Bag of cocoa. Bag of, sh bag of sugar. Bag of coal. Bag of coal. Do I have powdered milk? I have a bag of sugar. Where does one get powdered milk? Um, okay. We have a large bowl. <laughs> huh. Alright. I don't see anything in here. Nougat! You're the guy that's talking to me. Okay. Yeah, this is a bottle of... Oh, it is powdered milk. Oh, jeez. Okay, this is what I get for not reading. Reading is fundamental. Okay, so we pour... Oh, no, I don't want to put this down. I want to pour it, and I would need 17 grams of this. And 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and... Oh, stop. Okay, we need just uh, a little bit more. There we go. Okay, we'll put that there. We'll pick up our sugar and add 17 grams of that. Oh, I don't want to overdo it. And there we go. Okay. Add almonds to the pot. And we'll pour this. I feel like it's just going all over the counter. Oh boy. Okay. Oh no, wait. Nope. Nope. We still need more. It gave me a note of, okay, there we go. 80 grams of milk chocolate into a pot. Milk chocolate. Milk chocolate. Milk cho Oh, make 80, okay. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm being ridiculous. Oh, I gotta go turn the heater on. So we'll, no? No, it's on. Okay. So I think I just have to turn this up to... I guess we'll go up to 70. It says it's not working at optimal power, and I don't know why. Is there a loose screw somewhere? Remember to use the recipes in the book. I don't know where my recipe book is, but I'll keep that in mind. Okay, so we are one gram over, which, yeah, that's to be expected. <laughs> I'm not super great at pouring, uh, apparently, so it's fine, it's fine. All right, we'll just keep an eye on this and we'll stir it when it's ready. I gotta say, this isn't looking super appetizing. Okay, we're at 40. Uh, it's not giving me the animation, but I am stirring. Okay, so we'll plonk that down. We'll take that off the heat, put it down here, and then we'll shut our valve off. Okay, so now we'll pick this up, come back. No, we will not. We will put this onto the counter. We'll come... Oh, wait, no, it's open. It is open. Okay. So we'll pour it into here. Great. And we'll put that back down here, and then we will close the press and pull the lever press to stop working close the press hatch i did it it is it's closed there we go okay interesting <laughs> i don't know why it told me it wasn't closed 
Okay, and then we just wait for this, and then I assume we have to package it, box it up, and send it on its way. I'm really liking this. This is fun. So back in the day, I used to play Chocolatier. Oh, oh, wait, what? Uh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, let me grab our wrench. There we go. Uh, yep, I've got a bolt that needs to be tightened. So we'll just crank that up. And how about this one? Nice and tight. There we go. How about this one? This one as well. Okay. And, uh huh. No, I, I want to tighten. Oh no. What did I do? There we go. Okay. Okay. It's tightened. 100% tightened. Are we sure? Are we sure that it's tightened? Okay. We definitely need to fix Nougat because I feel like he could probably go around and fix all of our broken machinery while we make the chocolate. Come on. Come on, Press. You can do it. Don't fall apart. Oh, look at the screws coming loose. Oh, jeez. This is uh, not what I was expecting, honestly. Okay. And we'll tighten the bolt. And we will tighten the bolt. And keep it cranking. There we go. And the other one. Okay. This one really came loose. Okay. Tightened 100%. Tightness 100%. And tightness 100%. Okay. And pull the lever cronk. Please finish the chocolate. I want to make another sale. Come on, little machine. You can do it. Little machine. Gigantic machine. You can do it. You got this. Come on. Just press the chocolate. It's your one job. No! Oh my gosh. Okay, that's going to drive me a little bit bananas. Yeah, this one's definitely going to drive me a little bit bananas. Okay. And we'll tighten this one again as well. And I'm assuming the other side. Yep. Okay. And it's tight. Okay. Plonk this back down. I feel like I should just keep it in my hand, but I can't have two things in my hands. I apparently only have the one hand. I must have lost the other in some sort of tragic accident. Come on, press. Come on, press. Oh, boy. Okay. Tighten the bolt. This is gonna get real old real quick. Oh, I'm stuck on the lever. Okay. I would love to assign to robot, but I don't have a robot that I can assign it to. Okay, plonk that back down onto the table. Pull this. I still can't believe I lost my first bar of chocolate and I can't get to it. I mean, I can, because it's me, and of course, <laughs> of course I did that, but it's fine, it's fine. Come on, press. Come on, press. Please finish this chocolate. No. Oh my god, I can't. I don't know, man. I don't know. If this is going to be, like, the whole game, I'm, I feel like I'm going to lose my mind pretty quickly. I can't deal. Okay, alright, let's... Get this last bolt tightened again for like the 17th time. Okay. You are at tightness 100. Just stay at tightness 100. All right. Pull the lever. Like we made our first chocolate bar just fine. Just fine. But apparently that was all this machine could do. Okay. Come on. Okay. Okay, guys, I'll bring you back when this thing is done. Okay, so this is the eighth time in a row that this machine has broken. And I don't know if I'm going to be able to get past this part. I have been playing this game for about 45 minutes now. And I feel like I'm going to actually throw this ratchet wrench at this machine if I could figure out how to throw. Okay, so on that note, yeah, super cute. Love the theming. I, I like, I really, really do like 
that they don't have the crazy like cooking simulator physic mechanics in here. I like that I could just pour it into a bowl. I don't have to worry about making a mess all over the place. I like that it just goes into the bowl. I like that it just goes into the pan. <laughs> but I do not like this machine at all. At all. Like I, wait, is my, is it done? Can I just pick it up? Oh my God. Okay. We're just going to package this and we're going to see if it works. I said pattern, load. Oh, right, I gotta pull the lever crunk. Oh my God. Okay, it never gave me the notification that it was done and that I could just take it away. Uh, now I just have to go stick this into our little airship thingy doodler. Okay, you go in there, I press the button, then it goes into, uh, into the air. Okay, that I like. The machine constantly breaking, I don't like. I don't like that at all. I'm not a fan of that mechanic. Okay, where's our Zeppelin coming from? Oh, look at it! That is so cool looking. Oh wait, that's ours! There's just Zeppelins all over the place. This is really, really cool. I don't like the broken machine mechanic, though. I'm not a fan. I gotta say, I'm not a fan. But it is a playtest, so, you know, it can't be indicative of, you know, actual gameplay. So, we'll, uh, we'll just keep our fingers crossed that they keep, you know, they keep adding and making this game a little bit better. Okay. Hey, 100%. This is exactly what I needed. Thank you, Chocolatier. I will definitely return with more orders. Fantabulous. Huh. Thank you for playing the demo version of Chocolate Factory Simulator. If you enjoyed the game, we highly encourage you to add the game to your Steam wishlist and join our Discord server for more updates. Let the chocolate delight continue in the full version of Chocolate Factory Simulator. Okay. Well, I guess that's, uh, that's all we can do. I mean, I definitely had a lot of fun with it and, you know, let me know in the comments below if this is something that you'd like to see come to the channel when it comes out. It should be out in quarter two of this year. So yeah, but I mean, besides the broken machine mechanic, I'm really digging it. I really want to be able to unlock nougat. I think that would be really cool. But yeah, again, guys, let me know what you think in the comments below. If you like the video, please hit the like button. And if you like coming to hang out, consider subscribing as well. And I will see all of you later.